Hello everybody, um, welcome to Weight Loss Diaries. It is Thursday and I'm Stacy, your Thursday vlogger and it is November 19th. And I just want to do a quick intro. I didn't do much of it on my last video. Um, I have been, you know, engaged in a weight loss journey probably since 2005. Um, my first year was a really good one and then the next few years a few pounds here at a time. They usually did it in a lot of calorie counting and, you know, portion control food, cleaning up my cleaning up my diet, taking out some of the old foods. Good old diet and exercise is is the way I've done it in the past. Um, I'm still on my journey. I have gotten I started at 252. I've gotten down as low as 180. Nice size 12, nice comfortable in your skin and stuff. And then in the last year, a little under the year here, I've gained I gained about 25 or so pounds slowly back um, due to some um, personal knee injuries. I have just coming off from three months of knee surgery, so I am slowly winging myself back into it. Um, that is one of the reasons why I you know, joined or starting to vlog again and everything. I still am not able to exercise much. I'm still having a lot of pain and inflammation. Um, so a lot of my um, weight loss right now is solely on food and being conscious of what I'm doing and what I'm eating. I'm doing Weight Watchers right now, something really new for me. I'm in my week three because I really normally do like the other stuff. But I'm having the support and maybe a whole new different way of counting food is helping. I have no, normally done most of my weight loss online and a couple girlfriends, you know, here and there. But I need a little bit more uh, umps to go and weigh in in front of somebody and be more accountable that way. So I am at 208 this um, Tuesday on my scale, and I think it's like 210 on my Weight Watchers weigh-in. So I officially lost five pounds in the last three weeks. Um. At Weight Watchers and about six, you know, on my scale. So, you know, between five or six pounds, I'm down. In the last two weeks, I lost 2.4 pounds, so 0.2 pounds a week. And I, you know, I had a movie in between there. We had a family dinner with my family, like a family day. I took my girls, we did dinner and a movie, and a couple little things like that that I had to work around. So I'm really happy with, with my with my weight loss. Um, yesterday I had kind of a day where I didn't count and did a few things and one of the vloggers on here, I might be one of our diaries ladies, but because there's so many here I'm learning to get to know, made a comment. Uh, she was talking about what program she's done. She said she's been on um, Weight Watchers before and it just didn't work. And then she corrected herself and she said, you know what? The program works and it does work. She said, I kind of quit the program. And so when I was not counting my cal or my stuff yesterday, I wasn't well over, but I just you know, just, I don't know, didn't get to my thing and just was one of those days. That popped into my head and I thought, oh, don't start doing that because this this will work. And I think because I can't exercise as much, I get kind of self-down on myself that if I don't have diet and exercise, you know, it's no good. Well, that's not true because, you know what, diet is probably 75 to 85, 90 percent and the other exercise is just, you know, is a hint or helps out. So I have to focus on you know the diet, the the food, because if I'm going to make a lifestyle change for the rest of my life, I got to do that. I got you know hinder the, or got to get in the root of the problem, the food. Here I'm babbling. So weight, you know, the weight loss is slowly going, but until I can add some exercise, I know um, it's you know slow but surely. Topic of the week is Thanksgiving. Um, this I've spent many holidays. You know, last this is going into my sixth season of working around when I've been trying to watch what I eat. And I don't obsess about it. I go in there thinking, okay, I have the tools and know what I should eat. I'm not going to kill myself if I eat something different. Um, Thanksgiving is a hard holiday because it's just a, hard, a holiday of food. Somebody else said that on here. It's just, it's just an, you know, I'm appreciative of uh, why we have Thanksgiving, but it's just another reason for everybody to kind of overeat and revolve around food. So I try to take myself out of the kitchen, go, you know, my biggest tactic is I go talk, I engage myself and talk to people I haven't and family I haven't seen in a while to keep myself from out of being out of the kitchen. I love to help, I love to organize, I love to get everything on and going, but I have to take myself away from that. And I've even told relatives and they know I'd love to help because they know how I am, but they know that I, I need to be away from the food. 
So, you know, that's a tip. Go play a game. Go talk to somebody you haven't talked to in a while. You know, help out in other ways. Help help out by entertaining um, the person, whoever's house you're at, guests. Or if they're at your home, you know, if they're at your home, it's really hard when you are being the cooker, the, the main thing. So, I don't know much, much advice, you know, for that. Just uh, have somebody in there and, I don't know, keep talking. Keep your mouth moving and your hands busy. Um, so, you know, that's what I kind of do to concentrate through the holidays. Also, you know, you can look up alternative recipes, bring, you know, make some little pumpkin muffins and a few things like that to have on hand that if you really need to pop something in sweet, you know, a three-point muffin or something like that might help if you're counting points or you can make something that's lower in calorie as well. But, um, but don't beat yourself up about it. Like I said, it's only one day out of, it's only one, like we counted how many holidays there are out of a whole year. Well, even if you ate everything you wanted to on all the holidays of the year we we at Weight Watchers we figured it out there's only so many weeks out of the whole year if you just indulge even on those weeks or those days that's not going to hinder your weight loss of all because of all the good days and good weeks outweigh the bad so don't obsess about it because I think the more you obsess about it then the more you obsess about what to put in your mouth and you're more apt to break down and crave it and really want it well, I will probably see you next Thursday. So it is Thanksgiving. I am pretty sure I will pop in in the morning to give you my weekly update. And um, we'll see if we have a topic of the week. Um, Sundays, we usually find out what we're talking about. But I will probably see you next Thursday.